What what? It said the cat here. And I'm playing StarCraft. Well, 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 more precisely, I'm watching some games. Yeah, I just played these games a little bit earlier. Yeah, we, uh... I was, uh... Playing online, <laughs> you know, it gets pretty scary. But, I've been improving my skill, feeling better. Just feeling the flow of StarCraft. Feeling it. Not in winning, but I'm feeling it. I, sometimes I win. Sometimes. I'm not gonna spoil the ending. But I am going to analyze the play, the strategy, and the tactics involved. And anything thorough. Oof. So come join me in this journey of StarCrafting with with a semi noob. Hope I hope I'm a little past the noob, the noob the noob counter the noob level. Oh look at this guy full and throwing down two photon cannons like he's got something to defend against. Uh, uh, uh. Maybe he saw that early pool and was being a little defensive. Well I guess he should be because I'm spawning six count them six zerglings. <laughs> And now, what's up next? I don't know. Let's hear some circlings. We're not hearing them. I need to hear them skitter and then scatter. Ish. Ish. You must go. You're not staying. Oh, oh, get that probe. Holy crap, get him. Almost. So, so close. Oh, that probe has like 50,000 helps. Get him. Okay, finally. Now he doesn't know my tech. He doesn't know that I was going to get an extractor right there. <laughs> oh, drums are just flying around, being being idle. They like dancing. What a powerful little two cannon wall off. He's even got the probe just in case he needs to block a zergling. And he's got the gateway here. Uh, where? What did he start first? It looked like he started the gateway. Or a little around the same time perhaps protoss like the pylon there I'm checking everything out with my freaking overlord <coughs> the hero of the day oh look he's got a well defended oh I was firing on my overlord why would he do that What that overlord ever do to him? I don't know. It's a mystery. Is that a photon? No, that's a cybernetics core. And what does sexy cat have? A bunch of zerglings scurrying about trying to chase probes. They're nothing as usual. Oh, but the lair is incoming. So watch out. It's coming. <laughs> and more macro and supply and what do you know a sunken colony and what's going on up here is this drone it is a drone <laughs> if he could sneak and make a secret base oh it's a secretish secretish base i mean that's a decent place to expand just you know that's what no what the probe is going north like he's gonna find this place <laughs> Bastard. Wait, he didn't go far enough. <gasps> he didn't. I didn't even know. I gave up on him thinking he was going to find it. But he was just shift shift moving. He didn't even see it. Oh, and I could have made it. And then I was like, oh, fuck, he found it. Uh, <laughs> See, that's why these replays are great to watch. So look, I got Spore Colony in the front, in case you know, Dark Templars and Corsairs and Shuttles. Oh, oh. oh look at my mouse speed. Yes, yes. So Spire, I was, I've been into this Mutalisk carapace upgrade strategy against Protoss. Oh, he comes all the way up here, though. He must have just had him shift. I swear he's on shift tab. 
Oh, God. Yes. Great job, Zoiglings. Doing such... <laughs> killing. Killing the robots. It's great. Oh, what is this? What do you know? Gateways and stargates. Photion cannons. Look like a hatcheries. Sunkins. Inspired with carapace. Oh, yeah. Hey, look at Squidgies. They're coming around like they're gonna kill something. Oh, I was ready. Oh, look. I was ready for Squidgies. I mean, uh, <clears throat> for Corsairs. I wanted to get the initial air control. Then, you can extend that with the Overlords. Well, you gotta watch out, Protrust Ground Army, if you're not strong enough to withstand them. You know, I guess you should just get Lurkers. To handle them. It's troublesome. There's a counter to like everything. And then yet one thing can counter something that shouldn't counter encounter. Fuck, I think I'm getting zapped by my base. What? Felt it. Oh my goodness. Zip it zip zip the bell. Of course yes. This is going to be a Corsair theme song. Corsair, what are you doing? Just chilling there. Oh, you're going to... Oh, where are you going? Oh, there's something happening. Oh, flock! Holy crapola! Sending a horde of nonchalance. And all I got are like some Zerglings and Overs. Oh, but check it, check it, check it. Got the Mutalists defending the main base. But this is a little more dire. And yet, not in terrible shape. Oh yeah, look at the Zerglings popping out at the right time. Using some of the drones to fight. Is there anything going on here? Oh, now he's, he sees the Mutalists. Now he's like, oh, I better make uh, some photon cannons here. But I have to assume he's got Corsairs. Look. Oh, he's got legs on the Zealots. He must have attacked when he had legs, I guess. See, I assume... Presumably, Proton... I mean, Zerg should always go Hydralisks in this uh, matchup. So... Protoss, to counter that, makes lots of ground army, lots of speed zealots. Use the Corsairs to bring down the supply. He'll probably get Templar Storm. Oh yeah! Just, just causes some havoc. Did I kill any of them? <laughs> probably not. Oh, he's causing a lot more havoc. So I was able to hold off that first attack, but now there's a whole bunch of speed zealots just running skipping skipping to my loo up in here. Jesus! Oh, here comes the air force. And they're here to kill everything. GG is called. And that was that. It was pretty brutal. I didn't get critical mask for those mutilists. I defended one attack. I think I just did a little bit of hollow of... I should have done more like lurkers. I think I messed up my economy. I think that was... I, think I remember that, doing that game. Excuses? There's no excuses on economy? Yes, it was my fault. I, I take the responsibility, okay? Now that was, I think, Spirit of Fur, right? Now we're into Renexus. Renexus. 
That little tit bastard. Look at that beautiful splitting. Three over there, one over there. Beautiful. Run Nexus, you shithead. What are you gonna do this time? You know, every game is just so different. You can't ever prepare enough. You're always, like, balancing the last game. I don't know. I kind of have my own things that I like to do. Like dropping zerglings. Just dropping them. I just like dropping them around places. Oh, look at this drone crossing the space bridge. Where's he gonna go? He's going in the correct direction to scout his opponent. The white Protoss. Named Ronexus. Ronexus. He needs a theme song, doesn't he? Now there's a drone coming over here. He's gotta go over here. What is he gonna do next? I don't know. He doesn't know. What was Overlord? <laughs> Overlords look particularly fantastic with a Terran overlay. I do believe so, in my personal opinion. Oh, look at this SV, SCV coming up. What is he going to find? He's going to Hasselhoff the, the drone line. <gasps> oh, shit. What did he do? I get my expansion. He built on the high ground. The high ground. That's what it's called. Let's go a little bit faster here. Let's get to the next step. Oh. Popping a little bit on the SUV. Oh, the SUV hangs out on the bridge. I got an overlord floating like he's the Dickens over here. They got a one in the middle. He's changing direction to the towards the base. And then they got another command center building on the top. He's just very prepared for Zerglings. Very safe. It reminds me of me. I am just feel paranoid about the next things that are happening to me. And then uh, you got one sunken... With the Ovolution Humber. Some Lurklers loading in. And that satellite dish is spinning quicker than some kind of freaky spinning thing. Do you know any of those? Got two barracks. And a fistful of Marines. A few turrets to defend. And, uh, is he moving out? Gathering up. Two medics. Not enough medics. Not enough. What is this SCV doing? He is awful suspicious. Oh, a queen's nest. And leveling up to the hive. We got the Lorcas. Naturally, you want to speed up to getting defilers against the Terran player, but... Oh, the scan comes in. You see, I have the Hive, and he's like, fuck yeah, I gotta go now, because he's teching up. Oh, that, that stupid Zerg is teching up. He's at his weakest right now. Gotta go get him! Oh, he saw this. He's getting this first. No, don't get that base. No, no. It's not defended at all. This is the cheer, like the, the grandeur of the marching army coming to destroy this alien Zerg base. Kill the aliens! The aliens are bad. The egg! Destroy the egg! Shoot the fuck out of it! Yeah, it's gonna be a fucking Hydra! Kill the monsters! We are not the monsters! Don't kill us! No. Hey! It was nice! I wanted to build a base there! There's crystals that I want to chop up! Jeez! 
Well, okay, well, I got carapace. One carapace. Four sunken. To try to bust that. Of course, they won't try to. Because Terran supposedly has this idea that. Just deny Zerg the third base. Just deny Zerg the third base. And you're good. Everything's okie dokie. That's all you need to do. And you win, I guess. Not true. Uh-oh. What is he gonna do? Is he gonna... Well, like I said, usually they don't even attack this if I only have two bases. Which gives me time to... Build drones. And one lurker. I'm stacking the lurkers. And I was hiding some zer lurkers behind the... Behind the overlord. I have two stacked behind the overlord, so he can't even click it. Um. Is he? Oh. Oh, you do a little. You get a little closer. Oh, the Zerker gets a little closer. Oh, he does. Yes. I think I put him on hold position. Yeah, hold position lurker is like a trap. Won't notify until they're already across the bridge. And then Zippo spines up their spine. You know what I'm saying? I'm talking about marine faces rolling across the space platform, I tell ya. It'll be a fantastic time. I like it. Oh, buddy, don't even mess now. The filers are out. You know what? They start with Dark Swarms. So don't even mess. He's got 120, 130 mana. How you can cast Dark Swarm? You know what Dark Swarm is? Dark Swarm Shashwarma. Shashwarma. He's the base with best beef in best Taiwan. Best beef. Best beef in Taiwan. A second evolution chamber to get even more upgrades. Almost finished with the second carapace. And what does this guy got? Tanks? <laughs> a s an SU that's stuck? What a noob! Such a noob. Holy shit, I missed the best fucking part. <gasps> Look at all those zerglings! Okay, well, I guess he retreated, but... I sent him away, I tell ya. I taught him. I taught, I taught a putty and he went away. How great. Oh, what is he gonna do with a defiler? Don't know. Maybe he's gonna have these medic with the shield and the extra armor. One plus one armor equals two armor. It's a lot of armor from the freaking medics. Infantry only have one. He's got a third base. Maybe I, I, I have to just get a third base. You know, I wasn't able to use my economy with two bases. <laughs> oh, what are you gonna do? You gonna attack? Oh, yeah. Oh, slicing and dicing these marine spines. Fantastic job. This marine is only a private. So is that one. That is that one too. That one's too. Those are all privates. All private parts. First lieutenant. They're all first lieutenants. Why do I give them a rank if they always stay the same all the time? Fucking doesn't make, doesn't make sense. What are you saying, Zerg? Nothing. No point. Well, gee, there's no hierarchy, and there's only the Overmind, and Cerebrates, and then everything else. Queens? No, they're nothing special. They're just called that. It's preposterous. Just like the butthole on top of the spire is. Hey, did I make their second spire? I think in this game I made two spires, didn't I? Oh boy, oh boy, these Zerglings are gathering up. They're going to cause trouble in this defile. It looks like he's got something to do with the two. Oh, he's probably going to cast some spells. Some Zerg space monster alien spells. 
Oh, it looks crazy. This lurker's lurking across the field like he's got some business doing here. Oh, what? Oh, this is our turn army. Just chilling. Unsuspecting anything. But he doesn't care. He feels like he's, he's, in, he's doing okay. He's got all these bases. But is he going to expect Ultralisk with Carapace? No. So that's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking I'd... While the Terran's all calm with only whatever... Oh, God. Oh, fail. Cast too late, and then the Lurker went away, and... Yikes. That sequence is... Not exactly favored. Ugh. I swear, I can... I can do Defilers, yo. Oh, fuck. Yeah, this is this is rough business. Yowzas! Fire bats too. Mmm. Wars happening. It's destroying everything. Why? Yep, there goes the hive. The great center of the Zerg. The hive. It's quite PO'd, I believe. Did I keep going? Oh yeah, because there's Ultralists. Look, they saved the day. Super good against SK Terran. Look at that. Busting shit up. I th wonder how they would do well against tanks. Oh, I got the max armor. That's pretty cool. See, despite that, like, really brutal. I mean, for someone with only two bases, and you're supposed to have three bases. I'm pretty in pretty rough shape, as they say, you know? Especially looking at the, how many bases this guy has. I keep shocking myself <laughs> with my base. Wow, he's got like a million bases. Damn. Oh, because I'm contained, so he doesn't have to worry about me. But mine's pretty good against Ultralists. And Irradiate can do lots of damage, but uh. What's this guy's at? He's got two upgrades. And GG was properly called. What do you know? What do you say? Another StarCraft game, another day. Hope you enjoyed this. See you next time. Whoa! 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 <laughs>